have an AC unit? Does it leak? If so, we're gonna show you how to fix that. So last night we heard dripping going on with the AC unit and I thought the dogs were peeing in the house. So I hopped up to, thank God, not find pee but to find water all over the bottom. Before we get into it, we really quickly want to go over how the AC drain line is supposed to be set up. So exiting the unit, you have a pee trap. It's supposed to have a clean out, so if you can clean it out, it gets clogged. Ours does not, so we're actually gonna have to cut into ours. That leads down into your condensate pump, which will pump your water out. If this system fails, you do have an overflow here, which will allow the water to overflow so it doesn't build up in your unit. Now, it's supposed to have a pipe which runs down into an overflow pan. We don't have a pan or a pipe. The water was just spewing out all over our closet space here. We're gonna fix that though coming up. Before we get into the pipe to remove whatever clog is there, we're gonna go ahead and pour this bottle of water into the pump to make sure that it works. Hey. We have this hooked up to the pipe to suck out any potential clog. We actually don't think it's a clog anymore. What we think it we is... What we think it is is another trip to Home Depot. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's going to take another trip. The plumbing on this whole thing is all wrong. This pipe is actually supposed to be two inches lower than this and it's maybe a half an inch. So we think that the water is not even flowing out correctly because gravity is set up against it. We need to remove the plumbing, so we're gonna use a heat gun to melt the adhesive and see if the PVC will just come right off. <laughs> no! No! Talked about it a couple times. This is the P trap that we're replacing. We're gonna put a clean out right here where it should be with a cap that you can unscrew and clean this thing out if it's ever clogged, as well as taking this part and lowering it down two inches so that it actually drains properly. Of course, the last piece won't come off with the heat gun, so we're gonna cut it off and then we're going to fix the couple. So I'm sweating. Let's turn this on and see if it fixes our problem. So when we started the project, we thought that the piping was clogged. It was actually that our P-trap was not even a P-trap at all. It was more like a U-trap. They were totally even. We fixed all that, vented it correctly, and we're in business. No more leaks. No more leaks. So I'm going to get back to that chicken. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Hey, so this is the drawing of our P-trap and plumbing system that we just installed. And I think this is a great opportunity to remind you guys, look, we're not HVAC experts, um, but we knew a little bit and what to do for our plumbing. So this is just an idea. We're not saying that this will fix your AC. This is what we did that work. <laughs>